It's Morphin Time, Dragon Zord. What's going on? I hope you're more phenomenal today. It's another Mighty Morphin update. Um, I got something really special. Not a whole lot of people have it right now. I'm actually ahead of the curve for once. I'm really excited. Bam! It's the Pink Ranger Lightning Series collection. So excited. Really, really, really happy. Um, went to seven different Walgreens, searched everywhere. I don't even know you could get it right now, but it's been popping up around um, Walgreens and in Northern California where I am, so a couple popped up. Another Northern California collector, MCU collector, uh, posted on Instagram about it. I saw it. He said he's, he said he got it at Walgreens. I started scouring Walgreens, I was searching everywhere. I'm gonna have a really cool Kimberly search, Pink Ranger search video I'm gonna have to do because I collected a bunch of footage of all the fails trying to find it and i um, really happy I found it. I actually didn't even find it personally. Um, my Nana actually was like, oh, well, I'll check some on the way home since you're really looking for that figure. I was like, oh, hey, well, I appreciate it. I wasn't even counting on it. After my seventh Walgreens, she hit me up and texted me, oh, is this the one you're looking for? I was like, yes, yes, buy it. Oh my God, buy it, yes. So she did, she bought it and um, I have it. It's here. We're gonna review it right now. really excited so I have a few other lightning collection figures um, that I can compare them to with like the the, the Green Ranger two, putty two pack um, and then I haven't opened them yet but I think I'm open them to take some pictures that I'll splice in while we watch this video together uh, with uh, Zed and uh, White Ranger so we'll, uh, we'll we'll do some size comparisons and I you know I know it's Bandai that released um, these ones but I still kind of want to compare the Pink Rangers in case there's some of you out there that want to actually decide, hey, which Pink Ranger do I want? <laughs> you probably want all of them. I do. You know, Kimberly was like a, every boy's first crush back in the 90s. She was mine. Um, Amy Jo. Amy Jo Johnson, the actress. Uh, she's, yeah, so she's really awesome. She's beautiful. She's got a great personality. She had a great character in the show. And as you can see, you get a little, um, Kimberly head with it. So we're gonna compare them, we're gonna look at them, we're gonna do this right now, all right? So let me open up, uh, let me help Kimmy Kim here. I'm gonna have a, and these, these, these lightning ones, you know, they open up a little bit different. So I'm gonna slice it up here on the side, and then I'm gonna carefully, I, I told you, I've told you before in other videos, I like the packaging, I love the packaging. I try to be careful with the packaging. Love the packaging. Ooh. All right. Da, 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 da. Oh, a little white piece of paper falls out. They always put those with the uh, the lightning series. They put this like little legal paper, whatever. I don't know. You don't even need it. There's nothing else really in there. I do appreciate they they have these little uh, these little background things. So if you want to like take pictures of it later and stuff, you got a little something something you can use. I'll throw the packaging over there. So right off the bat, there was some stuff hiding behind the packaging. That happens a lot in the lightning collection. You don't even really see what you're getting. So she's got like some some pink energy that goes on the arrow here. She's got a karate chop hand and a fist. Karate chop fist, extra hands. The right hand is a karate chop hand and the left hand is a, is a punching hand. And so she's got her blaster and her bow and her um, arrow for it that looks like can go in her hands that she has currently equipped. And then the nice Kimberly hand. Oh, Kimberly. All right, cool. All right, I'm gonna open this up. I'm pulling out this first. This looks really cool. Energy. Energy. I've been working on the car this week, so my hands are all gross. You're welcome. And uh, there you go. There's the energy. Let's see. Whoa! Her arrow shot out at me like crazy. That's how much she loves me. I wish. Nice clean arrow. Hold it like this. There you go. Um, and it looks like you can put... Actually, I don't even know. It doesn't look like it goes together. It looks like this is its own arrow, which is interesting. It's like its own arrow in the energy blast there, or the energy, whatever you want to call it, energy. Uh, oh, man, okay, so these things pop out at you, apparently. Um, this is interesting. Um, her bow, on one side you have that, on the other, it's like notched. So you have these notches, I guess to put stuff in? I don't even know how that works. Did I drop the other side of the arrow? I don't think I did. That's really interesting, the notches. Um, I, guess, I guess that's the line of the bow when you actually put it on her. So let's pull her out. Let's pull out the Kimmy head. I want to look at the Kim. 
the Kimmy head, the hair looks cool. I don't know, dude. <laughs> the head looks kind of slightly, um, slightly weird. I don't know. Do you let me know what you think in the comments? You let me know. It's uh, just the face she's making, and I'll get some close-up shots of that in my photo box. But like, dude, it just it looks it looks slightly weird. She kind of looks slightly like goofy. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, a little bit. Um, let's check out Kim. Oh, bear with me. The sound of plastic. Okay, wait. Ooh, before you take her out, she does have those stupid rubber band things, and you can break her. So you got to make sure you get them off. Yeah, these stupid things. I hate these things that they put in there. But hey, if it keeps it safe during shipment, I'm all for that. So kind of like the, um, here's the blaster by the way, and kind of like the Green Ranger 2 pack, um, I wasn't super impressed with the paint that they use on these Lightning Series figures. It's very flat. It's very flat. Um, and then the helmet has a gloss finish. I don't know, that's just my personal opinion. I think some of the Bandai ones, um, she's kind of walking like weird there. I kind of got her all posed weird. She looks a little stubby too. She looks a little stubby, but I mean, maybe they're just, they're more accurate and that, I don't know, I don't know. I just, I don't know how I feel about the Lightning Collection so far. They're overall, they're cool figures and everything like that. They look great in the packaging. And then when you actually get them in your hand and you look at them, I don't know, my personal opinion is just that they're a little flat and the detail's a little, I don't know, they just, I almost like the Bandai ones better. I mean, but they are still really cool and they're definitely worth getting in your collection. And that's kind of a side-by-side -side comparison there that I'll, that I'll also show you in my photo box. But, uh, of, of, you know, and Kimberly's a little shorter than Tommy, which, which you would, you know, that makes sense. And then here's her up against a putty. And that's about, you know, she's shorter than him as well, so you're, the, the height is a, you know, the height, they look more realistic and more accurate, I think, but maybe that's why I don't like them, because they're not as, ugh. they were never really, like, super comic booky though, so I don't, I really don't know, I don't know what it is. I guess it's all, it's just personal preference. I just, you know, when you compare it to kind of, like, the old ones, um, look at the color on the other one from Bandai, and look at the morpher. It just, it's got more bang. It's got more umph, you know? Uh, the skirt is rubber, though. You know, I'm not trying to lift anybody's skirt here or anything, but the skirt is flexible, like on the Bandai ones. Um, and they both have side slits in the skirt, which helps, you know, be able to pose them. Um, I just, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. So let me put on the Kimberly head. And we'll look how that, see how that looks. Do, 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 do. She, she, yeah, she don't look that bad with the head on. She actually looks a little bit more proportionate with the uh, unmasked head than I would say like Tommy does. So um, she still does kind of have a goofy, hey guys, look to her face. But honestly, I still like it. It's pretty cool. You know, I'm not trying to be negative about it whatsoever. It's just a... Uh, you know, sometimes you have a little bit of different preferences and style and what you like. Um, let's try to put the bow in there and see what that looks like. But no, what I was trying to show you before uh, I dropped everything was you can pretty much, you can kind of get the arrow in the hand like that. And I, I'm probably going to drop it again. There it goes. See, it, I don't know. She's got her fingers that like, I saw another guy do it pretty well. But like you can get the arrow in between her fingers and rest it here and pose her and make it look look at make it look pretty cool. Like so, another I mean that's kind of like just another little thing where I'm like, oh come on guys, like you could have done a little more detail here and made it a little bit more accurate or whatnot. And I'm not sure if I dropped a piece or what, but I'm not liking the backside of the bow with the notches. There's like no paint. It looks very plain. It just I'm not impressed with that. It's just a white. Whatever. Like, I don't even know, guys. I don't even know. Um, what else can I say about it? I mean, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm still kind of getting a relationship with it. Right off the bat, not super impressed, but still cool. Um, like with the two-pack Green Ranger and Putty, I feel like I'm paying for the accessories. I'm not really paying for the quality of the figure. I feel like I'm paying for the Kimberly head and the bow. Like, I'm, this is what I'm paying for, I feel like, is the Kimberly head and the bow and arrow. And all. I'm not actually paying for a real quality figure and I kind of felt like that way with the Green Ranger and with uh, just the effects and the accessories in the Tommy head I felt like that's really what, what I was paying the 40 bucks for or the 20 bucks for was was the accessories that the figures came with so 
Still getting used to this whole Lightning Series collection. Still getting, still getting familiar with it. Um, seeing how I feel about it, you know? You guys be the judge, comment, let me know. Make sure you guys subscribe and let me know what you wanna see next. Uh, I'll have some polls in the video. And um, if you guys want me to show and display the figures a little differently, as always, you know, please let me know. Let me know down in the comments and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Stay more phenomenal.